Hello, and welcome back to Intravenous. Last we left off, we were heading out to some abandoned warehouses to find the shopkeeper, the murderer of Steve's brother, Charles. We made our way through some shipping containers and through a couple of warehouses. We are now on, most likely, the final warehouse. So let's continue, shall we? That'll be useful later. Those cans. Let's see, got a guy with a flashlight right there. Maybe I could, uh, throw that as a little distraction. Surprised he did not look around. I think guards would learn in games, too. Look in the opposite direction of where a loud noise was. Let's come on over here. Turn around, buddy. Okay. That was a bit scary, but we made it. I think it's about time we take out at least a light. Give us some darkness to work with. You. Get in there. Thank you. Finish you. Alright. Uh, guy there, I don't know if he has oh, he does have flashlights. Let's take out some more lights. Oh, that's thirsty. Nobody around the sea. Alright. Bring you back up. Uh, we will give you your own separate bathroom, you don't have to share it. Alright. Up this guy right here. Hello. Alright, thank you up. Uh, you know what, you'll get a buddy. Take that light out, so now we got a good path of lighting. Well, time to go in. With the shopkeeper dead, we officially avenged our brother Charles. However, Steve's got a few other ideas in mind. Take out more of these little lifes. Make sure something like that never happens again. Okay, got him there.
think I should be fine. Nope. I'm just gonna run on over here. Drop this guy right here. Maybe one gun. Maybe a little special on him. Thank you for not missing again. Let's take these guys out. Ooh. Hello, good sir. Excuse me, can I interest you in a knife? Don't have way down there. So we gotta get out of this warehouse and make a break for it. Let's take some shotgun ammo, sure, why not? Let's make a save. Uh. We'll just call this end. Let's get going. I killed everyone in there. Don't want anyone alerting game one. That was a bit redundant. Oh well. Uh, we probably could just sneak out through there. Maybe there might be a barricade down below. Let's just go with what we know will work, which is here. Hello. Fancy dying today. Too bad. You have no choice. Goodbye. Good thing they don't find missing people and just shotguns lying on the ground. Suspicious. Uh-oh. Well, out this door we go. Alright. Took him out. Let's keep on going. else around. Almost made it. Oh, now I'm curious about that building. Okay, not curious anymore. Let's get out. We did pretty good. A little bit careless, but high combat. Rank Rambo. And there are 57 total enemies we killed. Er, not killed, just total enemies 57. Killed 29 of them. Well, let us continue. And like usual, we have the HK G36 in our arsenal. It's pretty, pretty all right. You know, now that we have a little bit of time, we can finally get a real good look at this place. A pretty decent setup. The accomplice hooked us up. You know, maybe you take a few drinks. I've never actually seen what happens if we take a lot. Well, at least we have the accomplice looking out for us. Scolded us. We're complaining about the beer. It's a pretty nice setup. Steve, obviously a lot training. Right over there. 
I guess it is only fair to show off some of the weapons I wasn't able to use. Most importantly, a sort of eagle. It's pretty good, super powerful, highly accurate, especially at long ranges. Not my favorite, but you know, anybody can really make a decision what they want to use. We also got the Glock 18, if I remember correctly. It's one of my go-to pistols for this. Fully auto, good and reliable to have. In general, pretty nice. Alright. Let's go get our debriefing. Maybe inquire a bit more from the accomplice. Alright, we've got our debriefing. So we head out though, that will be the end of this episode. See you guys later.